Hello and welcome to my channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Slack Linux OS in your Android using Limo PC Emulator. So without any wasting of time, let's get into the video. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Slack Linux OS in your Android using Limo PC Emulator. So Slack's operating system is based on Linux and there are a lot of videos on my channel. Uh, I have shown in that videos, I have shown how you can run uh, any Linux in your Android with using Limo PC emulator. A lot of people commenting on my videos, it's impossible to run any uh, other operating system which we can run uh, in x86 processors. Uh, our Android phone have uh, another ARM processors. So let me clear, we are just uh, running the operating system uh, in the emulator with using emulator. We are not going to install it. We are just uh, running the operating system in a limbo pc emulator and some of the pc softwares we are installing uh, in android with using xagir so xagir is also pc emulator we are installing and using in this video i am going to show how you can run slack os in your android with using limbo pc emulator so first of all you have to download the uh, slacks os the downloading description and it will be in about uh, 7 uh, to, to 70 mb the downloading in the description and the download link is in description and i have provided the shortener link you have to bypass the shortener link and then you have to, then you get the uh, mega download link uh, i have used the shortener because it will get some revenue and help me to grow my channel so after downloading slack os you have to download the limo pc emulator application as you can see and there are a lot of videos on my channel and this is the uh, 5.1.0 version i am using So after opening Limbo PC Emulator, you have to click on the none, you have to click on the new and I am going to give this machine name Slack OS. This OS is based on Linux and I am going to show you all the settings of the Limbo or what you have to do in the Limbo settings. You have to get into the CP board and you have to select the CPU model uh, QEMU32. You have to select the course 4. RAM, RAM will depend on your smartphone specifications. I am selecting about to 1500 bit MB RAM and it will perfectly working with me. If it doesn't work, you can decrease the RAM according to smartphone. And here, here you have to do some important settings. You have to enable the MTTCG and you have to uncheck the disable S, uh, TSC. Lot of people commenting on my videos, they can't enable uh, the MTTCG because you have to use the latest version. If uh, you can't uh, check this uh, M to CCG, it means you are using the old version of the Limbo PC emulator. I recommend you to upgrade the Limbo PC emulator. I am using 5.1.0 uh, version. You have to download the same version and install, and then it will going to work. So we have done with the CPU and board. You have to get into the removal, and you have to select the CD. Uh, CD because uh, the Linux will only work with uh, CD. So now you have to select this Slack OS. The download in the description, and you have to select the boot, a uh, boot from CD ROM and uh, you have to skip all this part graphics audio you have to get into the network network uh, from the beginning i am uh, telling in my videos every linux will going to work with internet a lot of people commenting on my videos to, to show of os which will can work with internet so this is the os perfectly working with the internet i already told you the linux will work with uh, internet any linux so after getting to the network so this is the network setting you have to get into this and just click to none you have to click on the user after clicking user you have to select the network, network card you have to select rti uh, 8139 this is the card you have to select and you have to get into the advanced click to high priority so this is the all the settings you have to do in the limbo pcm letter so i have done the settings now you can turn on the screen rotation and you can turn the android phone to get the better view and better understanding so as you can see just now i've turned the android phone so let me just set up the camera and come back as you can see I have done all the settings in the limo pc emulator and make sure before uh, booting this linux you have to enable the internet connection it's maybe mobile data or wi-fi i have to enable my wi-fi and i'm going to click to play button after clicking play button as you can see the slack os is booting this os is based on linux and it will going to take some time uh, and it will start showing some scripts and commands it means the linux is booting here it will going to take some time so i am going to fast forward this video and come back to the next step
after waiting for some commands uh, you have to log in during this command uh, scripts uh, the login name and the password it will automatically appear on the screen so you have to just type and click to enter so it will going to automatically uh, log in so as you can see after login screen uh, the screen goes black it means the uh, slack os is booting up here and set uh, getting ready to uh, show the desktop so here you have to wait for few seconds So as you can see in the screen finally the Slack Linux OS has been successfully booted in my Android phone and as you can see this is the desktop of the Slack OS. So as you can see this is the mouse cursor and this is the uh, desktop of the Slack OS. Uh, after booting up and showing the desktop of the Slack OS I did not do any task because I recommend you to after booting up. Uh, don't hurry up to use uh, any OS wait uh, for few seconds until the all the operating system has been loaded in emulator because we are using this OS in the emulator so it will require a lot of uh, RAM and processor so it will using our Android phone RAM and processor which we already Android phone using so this operating system will work uh, slow so this is the menu button let me just click on it So as you can see this is our the some uh, preloaded softwares as you can see it's have a terminal the main important software of the linux file manager calculator text editor or web browser so this is the chromium web browser net manager so the internet is perfectly working because we have selected the internet uh, in the network setting and this is the video player this is the archiver task manager so this is all the uh, preloaded softwares of the slack os and this is the desktop and as you can see this is the very simple uh, OS you can use so every Linux is perfectly work in Android so as you can see this is the menu so let me just open the terminal let test the software is working or not at first attempt it will going to take some time to boot up or loading any uh, it will take some time to boot so as you can see this is the terminal software has been successfully opened here now you can type any command and do a lot of things like this so as you can see if you know some commands you can type here and can do a lot of things over here as you can see in the screen the software is perfectly working uh, and I'm going to end up this video because this video has taken very long time uh, you can test any software by yourself and let me know in the comments uh, all the features are working or not if not working let me know in the comments i try to uh, fix that problem and try to bring another video on that so as you can see this is the slack os perfectly working in android so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if any question or problem let me know in the comments thank you